Hello, my single solitary viewer, and welcome back to Project Zomboid. Again, despite uh, going to bed rather late, King Murdoch got some troubles sleeping, waking up early in a panic. Did visitors join him in this house? He wonders. Till then, he wonders if there's any way he can get a drink. And why did they put the bathroom so inconveniently far away? Just had to remember if there was... Oh, a plunger. Sweet! Sweet plunger of mine! Come on, brother! We'll uh, see if there's any threats. Watch the cooking show with the early morning, but I think that someone panicked for nothing. Of course, there's a lot of dead, <laughs> there's a lot of dead bodies in the area. Uh, we've got our generator and our set of wheels and an empty bottle for free. But uh, 1994, the apocalypse has begun. This is basically day four. And uh, it's time to sit on the floor and get ready for some TV. Some TV learning. We're going to wait patiently for the cooking show. There you go. We've got all that knowledge. And they, we just got suddenly the worst temperature possible. The worst weather, rather, to possible to drive in. This is uh, ridiculous. I am not driving with with the fog all around. Uh, it's already difficult enough to avoid basic obstacles for me, at least. Ooh, you're gone from a starship hur steamship hurricane. Oh, I think uh, I wonder if it's like uh, some ripoff of uh, Jefferson Airplane and and star and uh, starship and so on. And that'd be uh, that'd be their their version of '80s music. Like I can't see nothing. What am I supposed to do with this? All right, like this this is Kentucky, not England. And even I suspect that even in in England, this is this is ridiculous. This is like straight up Stephen King, The Mist. Did I hear a freaking zombie? I guess not. Uh, I'll have to remember to see if I remember or not to. Um... Oh, did do I have? Yeah, no, I could. I could. Do, what do I have on me? I've got uh, the keys, the metal bar. Oh yeah, I still don't have a saw. I'm pretty sure. Need saw and crowbar. And they give me a fog, so I can't even... I can't even do nothing. I can't do nothing, brother. This is not part of the plan. Let's see if there's uh, anything left at all in the kitchen. We've got a fresh lime. Wonderful. Uh, uh, this is dangerous uncooked, huh? And this is dangerous uncooked as well? All right. So here's uh, what... Uh, King Murdoch has learned from the cooking show. You put meat patties straight on the grill inside the oven and you turn it on. That is uh, how you do your cooking. <laughs> Even like when it's your first time in college, you've left home, you're in the dorm and you're like, oh man, I got this, uh, got these frozen meat patties. How do I do those? Do I just put them on the grill and turn it on? Oven cooked beef patties. <laughs> that's uh, that's how you cook. So the difficulty is like I don't really fast forward time too fast because I don't want to burn them either. So you know it's still at. See, it used to be frozen. Now it's at fresh uncooked. Oh wait, there's the cooking bar below. Okay, so we're we're still early in the cooking. Let's fast forward ten minutes. 
and the cooking is nearly done so uh, let's just keep an eye on that and we're gonna have uh, some some cooked meat that I, I'm no longer hungry for because I finished my salami uh, but I uh, you know I'm gonna have uh, I'm gonna just put that in my pocket Napoleon dynamite style and hit the road oh, oh it's burning wait 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 okay there you go and never forget to turn off the uh, oven because that's a great way to set to start a, a fire and burn down the whole town well uh, where at the really, very least one house so sometimes uh, we've been wandering around maybe in previous episodes you've seen because now you wouldn't see them at all but in previous episodes maybe you would have seen some burnt down buildings typically that's going to be the cause of the fire uh someone was cooking something and they decided to turn into a zombie instead but I, this fog makes it uh, so that I'm, I don't even want to freaking leave, bro. <laughs> I don't want to leave, bro. I'm gonna get rid of our boredom. Master fishing. Oh, exposure survival bait. Wait, does this place have a VCR? Let, let's grab this. Let's learn, because I've never actually... Oh, wait, I'm, leading, I'm reading the magazine. Never mind. I've never went so far into my survival that I've needed to actually use the VHS tapes. Uh, but at some point, you know, if you're an expert survivor, you can, like, set yourself a generator that that uh, feeds... Oh, did I actually grab it now? Okay. That can, like... Do they have, uh... How, how do... VHS... Place item. So they have VHS tapes, but they they don't have a VCR. Did I just place this on the ground? I did. Okay. Smart. Smart man. So uh, yeah, they have VHS tapes, no VCR. Very. Um, that makes sense to me, actually. Um, yeah. Let's read carpentry for intermediates. I wonder if. Uh, he doesn't understand. He's... I don't understand, brother. These words are way too big for King Murdoch. Wanna... Wanna power slam the words? Pal, drive them into the ring. I, between episodes, I should have looked like a... For a... Clothesline, brother! Yeah. I needed another wrestling move. <laughs> uh... Okay. Um... So I got my meat. Yeah, yeah. Well done. Well done. Well, I'll put the West Point map in the, uh, yeah, I'm sorry, uh, my, my single solitary viewer, but, uh, let's, let's go. Oh my God. Yeah. I just saw the, the icon for water and I'm like, I'll go get a drink before, uh, before tackling this fog. Like the fact that I just can't see nothing. I can't see nothing. So I don't know, for example, like I could walk right into a group of six zombies and, and then it's a right over, right over, right, right then. Shut up, birds. Birds don't sing when there's, when there's fog everywhere. So I've already been to this library and I know there's a zombie somewhere inside the house. And I say library, but it's just one bookshelf. But, yeah, I can grab Fishing for Beginners and read that. I don't want to start sifting around in the boot of the car. And I'll actually go back to the house, which I know is safe. <laughs> And uh, read until uh, the this fog dies down a bit. Hopefully, like the sun will rise for realsies and get rid of this. Let's learn how to fish. Th fishing is not at all part of my plans, but uh, yeah, that's the that's the that's the learning experience we have. Our boy is hungry. Here we go. Stop reading, my friend. Start eating instead. Whoops.
the, f- uh, the fog has gone and we can hit the road. I was thinking about going to American Tire and um, get uh, get me some of them tires. And if I do that, I'm going to grab a canned soup. Hey, wait, wait. The working out show. What is that? A noon? Noon. Okay. Right. I'm not even sure what skill I learned. Because <clears throat> I just saw the words working out, but I, I don't think it's a, it's a fitness show at all. So what I want to do is go to American Tire. I think there'd be a chance of finding tools there, including a crowbar. If I can get that. So we'll grab this generator, put it on our knees. Get in the car. And drive down American Tire. So American Tire is just on the edge of town. And so... As a result, there's a chance that I might be able to uh, get in without too much trouble. I'll try to not draw in too much of a crowd. But, uh, you know, if I tried to raid the school over there for books, and I think I got most of the books I, I, I wanted. So I don't think I need to run that risk quite yet. Just a little bit disappointed I didn't find a... Uh, I have several hammers, but still no saw for disassembling uh, wooden furniture and that's of course you can make planks and get nails and stuff like that and you can barricade a base with that uh, if I want any hope of uh, barricading a, uh, <laughs> a baseball stadium that's the main goal of the, the entire mission um, I'm gonna need uh, to be able to do a lot of that uh, so I, I'm gonna need uh, some table saw so here's the the gas station and here is downtown We've got important places like the uh, Enigma books right there. If you're looking for skill books, that place is going to have... Oh, shit, this is not the place to stall. Oh, okay. The car is really not super reliable. I don't want to think about what would happen... Dang it. If I decided to stall on the highway or something. Let's go around Gigamart. Next to Spiffo's. And we'll make our way across town. To American Tire. Yeah, I know I'm still again back at the Gigamart. So there's a lot of cars in those parking lots. Uh, but it, perhaps one of them would be better than the, the ride I currently have. I know not, I know not. But beyond these train tracks right here is the American Tire. It's right across the street down below, right here. This is the place. So this place has, obviously it has a lot of car parts, tires and so on. But most importantly, I think, a chance potentially of, of, uh, all right, let's, shit. I already am losing time. Let's drop this. Thank you. And just in time to... I need to find my weapon. Where is it? Please. There you go, metal bar. Equip primary. So, yeah, this is why I didn't uh, like the idea too much of carrying that generator on my knees. What's the, what's the condition my condition is in? Metal bar, not very long-lasting. Hopefully I'll find a new weapon inside the, uh, inside the big store here. That's the... That's the mission of the day, brother. Oh, uh, got a lot of zombies that have been following the car. Mm-hmm. King Murdoch on the brow. Gotta try and uh, sneak by. 
Make like a heel. Hide the brass nuts, brother. It's locked. Being real discreet. We're gonna grab this garbage bog. As, uh, the, uh... The canned soup, brother! I could have done that with the tote bag. Pay no mind. Let's try both doors. Because one of them could be unlocked. That's not the case, brother. Not the case. Not the case! Can I enter by the main entrance? What's the zombie population looking like inside? All right, we got a we got one entrance. I do hear some zombies. There you go. I knew you were not alone, brother. Do you have a lighter? No, just a house key. Thank you. However, I think this house key might be the key to, uh, to this entire place. <laughs> so we got a wrench, car battery charger. The car battery charger sounds useful. Sounds, sounds pretty useful. I'm gonna try and see if that fits in the bag. Uh, let's look around. The wrench could actually be a better weapon than the pipe. At this point, because of the pipe is just so, so damaged. Screwdriver, we got a jack. Tire pump. Our boy's thirsty, more screwdrivers. The wrench, can I use the wrench as a weapon? Yes. Okay, so let's, oh boy. Let's switch with the uh, metal bar and grab the wrench as our main weapon now. Look around, screwdriver, still would like a crowbar. I don't know if I'm going to get that. I might get that in the back. I mean, you know, when you need to, you want to repair your car and, you know, the, the boot just refuses to open and you need uh yeah, how many wrenches do you need in how many different... Okay, alright, alright. Oh, car battery charger, already got one of those. Okay, that's, uh, that's about that. I think uh, a lot of the shelving units have um, tires, which is not what I'm looking for right now. Performance tire, like I can't change the tires on the car, so... It's just, I don't have the knowledge. So it's kind of a... It's a, it's a moot point, one could say, because even if... Uh, I basically have to, at this point, I have to change the entire car if there, I have a problem with the tire. So, well, actually, I've seen cars roll around with three wheels. It's just... <laughs> You're, you're going to have to start looking for uh, fresh wheels really, really, really soon. Um, yeah, yeah. So it's all all sport tires here. Sport, heavy duty, well, what, whatever you, you want. Let's look in the garage area. Is there... Are there friends around here? Performance brake, more spare parts. So yeah, you got really everything you need if you need to fix up a car, more or less. Toolbox and wrench. Starting to run out of time, brother. I was really hoping for a... Uh, really was hoping for a crowbar in here. Did not get one of those. Red pen, paper clips. A, a bag of garbage. Did I miss... What did I see? Sheet of paper. Yeah, yeah, that's that's about it. 
Uh, there's got to be a bathroom in here, though, so I can uh, drink or something. There's a... Uh... So, like a mini fridge like this. <clears throat> oh, fresh burger. Hell yeah. Though, uh, I'll grab the grapefruit and the orange. I gotta like, I love my vitamin C, brother. Gonna eat all of the damn fresh burger. That's right. Mmm, fresh burger. All these fresh burger vitamins in my mouth, brother. Uh, the water cooler is the kind of thing that you do want to harvest and bring around, but I already have enough trouble with the generator as it is. One thing at a time. If I try to juggle too many balls... <laughs> if I try to juggle too many balls, these things are not going to go well. Um, wait, oh, the water cooler, however... I can't believe there's no bathroom in here. Let me, uh... There was no bathroom, right? Did I hallucinate? But, I mean, the water cooler will have water, though, so I'll... I'll, I'll grab my drink. <clears throat> there you go. And I'll, I'll even... No, I'm not gonna wash with a water dispenser. I know I'm... I know I'm unclean, brother. That's no reason. So, crowbar mission still ongoing. Okay. Got a lot of boys. How many How many of yous have seen three? Three have seen. Good God, what is he doing? Will you let me freaking drop? Why does he not equip this as a primary weapon? Does the wrench not work as a weapon? So normally I would say, spare your car. Don't use it as a weapon. But uh, I, I, I appear to not be able to equip my weapon. Whoops, I don't want to run over the generator. Though. Come on. Learn how to drive backwards, you fool. I don't go to the DMV, brother. That's how the government tracks you. Uh-huh. someone have a lighter I'm so tired of not being able to have my cigarettes don't smoke kids ay 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 and uh, apparently don't take the smoker trait because nobody has freaking lighters in this universe or matches just little matches take the freaking generator get inside the dumb car Start the dumb car. I said start the dumb car. Thank you for cooperating with me on this one occasion. It's already... Oh my god, it's already six. I need a place to hold up for the night. Is that American Tire? They had a lot of food. The 
think I think I'm sleeping in an American tire for the night. What the heck was that, like, raging cow screaming at full? And now he wants to... Okay, so I guess it, because of the panic he wasn't uh, equipping the, uh, the wrench? I don't know. There's some subtilities about this game that sometimes I just don't understand, dude. Okay, please have freaking... Again, too much to ask. Too much to ask. Too much to ask. I'm just going to grab the uh, watches and the screwdriver I saw. And have fun with dismantling watches. <laughs> And we're going to be spending the night at American Tire. Why? Well, because I've already handled the threat around here. More or less. I left the door open like a champion. Yeah, so you got a few wandering down the... Oh, okay. Where do you guys come from? Why do you mysteriously wander your around to all the way to the door? How'd that happen? Again, grabbing the watch, just uh, because when you've got a little bit of downtime, the reason... Okay. Okay, I like that they're wandering away. One of them, at least. Both of them. Okay, do it. Um, though, if they could avoid wandering inside the store... That'd be good. I don't want them smashing uh, windows for nothing. High performance crap. Did I really look at all the uh, all the containers around here? Car battery, garbage bag. Oh yeah, there is a bathroom. I, why did I drink from the uh, water dispenser? Lots of garbage bags around here. So this place is actually fairly popular as a base because if you decide to, for example, break one of these windows, yeah, you, you can actually go on the roof. Like uh, here, let me let me demonstrate. We're gonna remove that broken glass, brother, and then we're gonna climb through. That was not the demonstration I was looking for. Uh, I thought I thought that, that that led to the roof. Um. Okay. Thankfully, uh, I think he uh, he didn't hurt himself. I'm, uh, I'm used to making dives, brother. From the third rope down to the ring. One, two, three. Your winner, King Murdoch, ruler of the ring. Paperclip champion. There's just nothing up here. So okay, all right, all right. Well, well, I mean, you find what you you uh, with the carpentry skills, you uh, create <clears throat> a uh, something we call a uh, ladder, a staircase up to the top. Up to the top. You got paper bags, plastic bags. In which we can bleach and sponge, screwdriver. Okay. And I closed again a door in my face. Now, uh, there's big windows back there, so I'm not going to hang around in that room. Maybe this room is going to be the spot of predilection. I might be able to escape through there or through there, depending on which side a threat comes from. But obviously, I don't have a TV in here. What I do have is uh, wandering zombies on the... Yeah, yeah, it's all tires. All tires. I mean, the, the shelves look like they have other stuff. But it's all tires. So, 
let's have fun. Uh, oh, I don't even have enough. Okay. I don't even have enough electronic to start dismantling stuff. I can just dream of cigarettes. So I've had to abort the plans I had um, because it's not a good idea to go on the road at night. Um, and when your character is very tired like this, their awareness is reduced. They're not good at fighting. Uh, the, the depression <laughs> is not great either. Um, to be fair, uh, one of the cures for depression in this game is to have a cigarette, which I don't, if I only had a lighter, that'd be, uh, that'd be neat. Or, alternatively, I close the door in my face again. Alternatively, maybe go outside. Um, characters are, don't like the inside as much. They think it's a little bit, a um, little bit uh, less fun. A little bit like, oh, lunchbox, nice. Score. Score, brother. And I'm gonna save the spy slice for last. But this is where King Murdoch spends the night. I want to thank you for watching the episode. Leave a like if you want to tell me. Yo, Flues, I like these episodes. Keep it going. Leave a like. Uh, and of course, if you don't want to miss the episodes, make sure you're subscribed to the channel. And if you're not really getting the notifications that you, you think you should be getting, make sure the notification bell is on. And if you think a little too tall and you want to call me Shorty, cutting my legs off is the... Uh, main means of being able to do that truthfully uh, so cut my legs off and then call me shorty but you can't do that at king murdoch mm, brother you can't kill you can't cut king murdoch's legs and you can't him can't call him shorty mm, no way brother and uh, that's where he's gonna sleep sleep the night and we're gonna wake up next episode Thank you very much for watching, and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye. Sponsored by the Flues Crew on Patreon.